audits are changing, and data and analytics is at the core of some of the most exciting changes. You are using data in ways that you didn't do you know, 10, 15 years ago. And we are able to take that data and bring that different angle, that different perspective on it. But what we can also do is use some of the capabilities that we have within our firm and some of the data that we have across our client base. We can use that to have real views and perspective on the industry that we never had before. I think a very good example of that is actually around journal entries. Many of my clients are huge global organizations, posting hundreds of thousands, if not millions of journals on a monthly basis. How do we identify the risky journal entries? Well, we now have tools that can really interrogate that data, can look for certain characteristics in that data, and basically send back to us a report that says, actually, these are the top 100 riskiest journals that have been posted this year in this client. There will always be judgment. There will always be judgment in an audit. What DNA enables us to do is to make a more informed judgment. It gives us access to not just more data, but the correlations and what that data actually means. So it gives us access to think about the different scenarios that could happen and the different probabilities of those scenarios happening and say, well, you know what? If we model these very complicated scenarios, this is what it's showing us.